Since we are talking about Dell, I'd like to also show a case that we used to work on Dell's B2B marketing. Within the B2B sales, you can see that purchase uh, process is getting more complicated. When we work with we work with Dell, basically they want to promote their servers because servers are high margin, high profit products. And Dell people are thinking those are small and medium sized companies when they are purchasing Dell servers, they should already be uh, Dell customers. They either purchase our uh, Dell's laptops or desktops before they start considering Dell servers. When we are looking at data, we find out that is not the case because about a third of the Dell's server purchases are new buyers. They have no previous purchase history in Dell's database. Why? Because a lot of our startups or uh, small business, when they are starting their own business, they have not enough budget for Dell laptop or desktop because there are so many lower priced generic brands but when their business start growing they think about warranty like like quality and uh, services and that's why they are thinking about the more what brands they could choose they will come to Dell because it's such a uh, brand with a strong reputation and that's, that's what we are seeing in data one third of the, one third of them never purchased a, a Dell laptop a Dell laptop or desktop before so we actually use that to data mining a new market, potential market. And they'll, because these customers, when before they make the purchases, most of them will make a technical inquiry. They will call in their customer service and ask what's the, the best price they can get. Is there any like warranty, extended warranty they can provide? And after three or four months, they will make a purchase. And that's the pattern we actually see in the data. So why don't we prioritize this course other than the regular customers, which we don't really have information, their purchase intentions, and the campaign is a real success compared with other software campaigns. With this Dell case, let's go back and review the four W's we are supposed to answer. The first question is who? It's very clear that during the case, we are targeting those kind of startups who may not have the necessary budget to buy uh, Dell desktops, but choose to buy the Dell uh, server for its brand and reputation. In fact, those startups usually register at the local business bureau and it's very easy for us to capture the possible information and identify the potential buyers. The second answer to what? So uh, that's the same answer almost provide the answer for this one. So what they are looking for is our brand, our uh, quality and our service service guarantee. So as a promotion, we can consider using extended warranty as a very key factor to drive them to purchase. Or we can extend the coverage of our service, say changing it from a standard call and we'll get your service to a more 24-7 standby service. And the third question is when and fourth is well. So that takes a little bit more data mining, but as I was saying, we find out most of them will give a technical inquiry about server products a few months earlier. So considering that indicates their decision making takes two to three months, we can start up ahead and pick out the potential clients and send out regular communication messages. And finally, well, because they are making telephone calls uh, and we can also get the information from other channels, we should leverage all the possible channels for our potential clients and maximize our sales efforts. So in summary, let's answer our four W's after our Dell segmentation.